Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get this fun, colorful, kind of pastel metallic look. I don't even know what, how to describe this really. Um, so if you'd like to know how I did it, just keep on watching. Starting off with my eyes, I went in with the BH Cosmetics Modern Mattes Palette. And I took that light pink shade on a Wet n Wild blending brush and I put that right into my crease. Then I took this standard pink shade on the same brush and I put it into my crease, but just a little lower. And then I took this kind of purpley pink shade. I don't know, it's like a fuchsia. Um, I'm not even sure. And I took that on the same brush as well and I put that even lower into my crease and blended all of those colors together. And then I am repeating the same steps on the lower lash line, starting off with the lightest pink shade, then going to the pink, and then going into that fuchsia color. And I was feeling a tad lazy that day, so I already had my foundation, concealer, and powder on, and of course my brows. And this video was pre-filmed before I had my hair the way I have it now, so I am wearing a wig right here. But if you follow me on Instagram, you know how my hair turned out. So I'll actually be showcasing my actual hair in my videos to come instead of just straight wigs like I was doing. So next I went in with the BH Cosmetics Foil Eyes Palette and I took that very icy pink shade and put that on the inner third of my lid using a flat shadow brush. And these foil shades are just going to act as a base for the cream shadows I'm going to be using later. Then for the center of my lid, I went in with this icy green shade. And these colors are going to be corresponding with those cream shadows. So it's going to go from pink to green to blue. Then for the outer third of my eye, I'm taking this bluish teal shade and I'm packing that right on with the same brush. Now starting off with my first cream shadow, I went with the ColourPop Supernova shadow in the shade over again. And I'm placing that over that pink shade I laid down. And then I'm going back in with that flat shadow brush and I'm just blending out the edges so that it transitions into the next color smoother. Then for the green, I'm going in with the JCAT 3D Eye Topper in the shade Wink Tink, popping that into the center and then using the brush to blend it out again. Forever. I don't wanna, I don't wanna give you up. 
And then finally for the third shade, I went in with the J Cat Eye Topper in the shade Azul Lemonade. And I put that right over the blue on the outer third. And then I moved in a little closer just to give you an idea of how it all blended together and how it looks up close. And then I wanted a little more depth on the outer corner so I went back into the BH Modern Mattes palette and I took that purple shade using a defining crease brush and I just put that into the outer corner of my eye. Next, I went in with the Butter London Double Decker Lashes Mascara and coated my top and lower lashes. For contour, I went in with the Wet n Wild Contour Palette in Dulce de Leche, and I used a crumb brush to carve out my cheekbones and my jawline. And then to go with like the pastel softer colors, I went in with the Wet n Wild Color Icon Blush in the shade Fantastic Plastic Pink using my favorite Royal and Langnickel Muda Pro Pointed Blush Brush. And then for highlight, I went in with the BH Cosmetics Blacklight Highlight Palette with the shade On Point. And I highlighted my cheekbones, the tip of my nose, the bridge of my nose, and my cupid's bow with the Wet n Wild Unicorn Highlighting Brush. And then I wanted to just go all out, so I went in with the Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit Lipstick. And I think this is the shade Blue Blue, but you could of course pair like a pink with it or even a nude, anything that you're comfortable with. I just wanted to go the extra mile. <laughs> And that completes this look. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you in my next one.